poor Cindy. Her grandfather had lots of money. But when he went broke, she reluctantly married her rhinestone cowboy, Alabama, just after he'd struck oil. <laughs> Great sense of timing our Cindy has. Ah, uh, but the high price of survival in Balboa. Looks as though oil's not well. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about survival, you've just got to meet our local movie star, Rita Carlo. Years ago, she was at a answer to Shirley Temple, but now she's trying to pan enough Balboa gold to make her way back onto the silver screen. Rita's not too happy with husband Tony, a sometime tennis pro who plays most of his love games with teeny boppers off the court. <laughs> And I've seen you, likewise. Good enough to play tennis for me, I can teach you. Really? Absolutely. Rita, how nice to see you, dear. <laughs> Rita, you'll never guess who this is. Go ahead, guess. I just cannot think now. It's the Woodbury's little daughter, Rachel. Robin. What? My name is Robin, Mr. Carlo. Oh, yeah, Robin. And uh, you can call me Tony. Now. Well, the last time we saw you, you were a little girl. And now look at you. You're all grown up and high school students. <laughs> it's college, Mr. Carlo. Oh, college. Thank God. I mean, isn't that great? I mentioned an animal husbandry, Mrs. Carlo. So I see. Um, nice to see you, Mrs. Carlo. Save a dance for me, Rachel. Robin. 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 How cute. As they would say in America, it's Robin the Crane. Oh, that's very funny. Very oh. funny. Oh, hey, Ernie's here. Hey, yes, Ernie. I'm going to get Ernie's dollar to finance my next thing. Okay. Joy Eastland does all of Ernie Stoddard's dirty work. If Joy seems a bit catty, it might be due to the fact that she is Balboa's famous ex-madam. And there's Erin Blakely, the one woman that dear old Ernie hasn't been able to buy. At least not yet. <laughs> 